Hi and welcome to this short introduction to the ELAD software SW2. Um, as you'll probably know from my website that um, I use this all the time for HF Aero DXing. I find the software is extremely um, user friendly and suited to this particular hobby um, mostly by virtue of the fact that we can um, show in the spectrum window all the database items from the memory files. So for example I expect to see Mumbai sometimes come up on this frequency and Shanwick. Purple ones for HF data link and the yellow ones are for the Volmet channels. So down here on the right we have the actual um, database items or the memory items all colour coded the same as they are shown in the spectrum um, so I can just uh, single click on or double click on one and it changes and tunes the receiver to the frequency so what are we listening to at the moment we're listening to should we listen to New York it's now hmm, 1735 local time Also have San Francisco. You can see United Flight being cleared to climb and maintain. And just tune off so I can uh, spread a few words and and just say something about this. Um, continue. Here's the uh, quick buttons, quick link buttons I call them. Um, I can tune straight to a particular band, um, 17 megs band for some of the um, HF data link um, and some of the long distance operational control frequencies. Um, do notice these lines come up um, reasonably often they're generated by um, the monitor. I'm not too sure how I'm going to get around that. But um, anyway, that's these what these buttons are for. So 30 megs band, just quick single click, and it tunes straight to um, a particular frequency within the band, and you can see all the range of um, channels that we expect to see on 13 megs. 8 megs is always busy. Um, my aerial's tuned for that, so um, just continue looking around here. We have. Um, time is it? It's 5.37, so this will probably be Gander or um, New York, although it says Auckland there, it's actually a vomit frequency because it's coded in yellow. And there's the usual tones of Gander and New York vomit. So if I actually want to tune um, up and down, I can use the, the small scale. I can get up to um, not too sure of this on digital mode. Some Asian fishermen. There's New York again, and you can just tune by uh, grabbing hold of this and up and down, or you can tune by more drastic measures, um, so I can tune right down to the 6 meg band quite quickly without having to use these buttons here. Using some of the controls I can lower the threshold of the automatic gain control um, so it's not so loud. I'm putting some noise reduction, but that's not effective really unless you've got reasonably strong signals. So, let's step back to 8 megs. And San Francisco. So it's a bit like fish in a goldfish bowl, but um, or talking into a goldfish bowl. But um, it does reduce the noise a lot and makes it a little more pleasant on the ears, um, as long as you've got a decent strength signal to listen to. 
There's Australia Flight Week. There's the nose reduction off. Okay, that's a quick intro to the uh, software for um, HF Aero. Um, look forward to seeing you visiting the website soon.